Yeah. Hey everybody, this is this all about Albert back again for another dip. And this morning, it's about 7:47 right now. Uh, my buddy Aaron came by and he said, "Hey, I watched one of your videos and I like them, but I want you to try my chew." And that's the Grizzly Wintergreen. This will be the first time I've ever dipped Grizzly Wintergreen. Period. I well. I put gri Grizzly in my top three, which didn't make sense because I've only tried two different kinds of chews. But I figured I'd just throw that in there. But I'm going to try and see if I like it. I didn't have a can to put it in, so I pretty much just... I don't know if you'll be able to see this, but it's right there. There. It's a pretty big size dip. But anyways, I'm going to put it in. I'm going to tell you what I think about it. First, I don't have the can, so I can't do appearance, but it, first of all, wintergreen is probably the most popular flavor there's get for any chew. Uh, every, you know, brand has wintergreen. Um, Grizzly, you know, I watched, uh, Joey Led's Biffin, uh, I watched his, uh, review on, he said it smelled kind of chemical, you know, chemical. And I smell it, and it it does. I don't know what you know. It just does. There ain't. I mean, that. I guess I could blow past it if it tastes good, but I don't know. Let's see. And yeah, I still need to get better at this game. All right. Now I got me a dip in. And I don't have my fucking can. Son of a bitch. I'll be right back. I'm back. Got my venom can. Alright? I love this. Anyways. Break. Okay, so my first impression on it is wintergreen. When you first start out chewing, I recommend skull flavor kind. Don't let anyone ever tell you that start out with Copenhagen or Grizzly. I mean, as much as you'd like to man up, chances are you're gonna puke. You're not looking too man there while you're, you know. People are like, mm, you're a pussy. All they get to do is laugh at you. Skull, really, either way you're gonna throw up. I, there's nothing else I can do about it. Well, I can't do anything about it, but what I mean is, is, uh, you know, you're gonna probably end up throwing up. But, anyways, the taste does it. It doesn't taste as chemically as it smells. It tastes when, like wintergreen, you know. I've had Skull Wintergreen, um, yeah, I kind of like it, you know, I like it, it doesn't give me a good as burn as Husky, surprisingly enough, I feel like it'd give me a stronger burn, but it doesn't, um, no floaters, absolutely none, uh, the spit, it'll, it gives you good spit, that's just me, I don't know, you know, about you guys, um, I don't know if it'll hold this flavor for a long time. It's still holding the flavor, but I, you know, literally just put it in. Um, you know, another thing, uh, if you guys have any questions, you know, I'd like to do a Q&A video. Uh, a lot of people that I watch videos from, you know, Cajun Tiger, I think, and, you know, Joey Leds, Dippin', and then uh, Ninja Dipper all have Q&A videos, and I think that's a great idea. So if you guys have any questions, well, I've not been chewing too long. You know, you can ask me a question about, you know, just about me if you want to know me better. And I'm cool with that. I'll do a video on it. <laughs> oh, hang on, I got a little bit more. I want to put a little bit more in because I don't feel like I have enough. See? Hang on. I can't see it. It'll share that you guys want me to put it in. Anyways, uh, yeah, you know, uh, my next review, someone asked me if I wanted to, uh, if they wanted me to do Grizzly straight, 
and I'm fine with it. I'll do it. Um, that'll be the next one I buy. I'm going to get 20 bucks. So, I'm going to do Skull Peach, Grizzly Straight, uh, Copenhagen, or, no, uh, ah, uh, uh, fuck it. I, I can't think of it right now, but, um, anyways, yeah, I'm going to get a couple flavors so I can make more for you guys. This is actually my longest video yet. Um, I was at my buddy Aaron's last night, and I came home this morning, and we chewed up all my cherry skull. Once again, I got really sick of it, you know, but still, if you're first time chewing, you'll like it at first, but you won't chew it more than once after that. Um, just until maybe a month later. Anyways, let's get back to this. Like I said, it's still holding its flavor real good. I got... Actually, I'm getting a, a couple floaters now. Maybe it's just a new part that I put in that wasn't packed. You know? But I can see why people would chew this. It's a... It's a good chew. Grizzly's respected. It's a respectable chew. I know it's a favorite. Um, I'm starting to get into the stronger stuff. Nothing gives me a buzz. I've already said that, you know. But I really... I enjoy this. I could, I could dip it. I couldn't dip it all the time. Um, for some reason, Husky seems to be my favorite. I still need to. Here's the brands I haven't tried yet: uh, Kayak, Copenhagen, uh, Cope. Um, I haven't tried. Uh, oh, I've tried Stokers. Yeah, I think that's right. Yeah, Stoker Stokers is pretty good. Um, I don't know if that's right, and if it isn't, I'm. Um, you know, let let me know if Stoker's... I think that's what it's called. Um, if not, then I really just embarrassed myself. But, anyways. Yeah. Um, I give this probably 8 out of 10. Just because it smells chemical. You can't taste the chemical as much as you can smell it, but it's still there. You, you, you know, you can, you can taste the tobacco... But you can also taste the wintergreen. It seems like the, the flavor is just as strong as when I put it in. Now, that's not saying much. It's only been in seven minutes. But, uh, yeah, I recommend you go out and try it. If you're a new guy, do skull at first. Or, you know, don't take my word for it. Do whatever you feel is right. But skull is definitely the easiest to start out with. Um, but then, then, I want you to, I want you guys to try. If you're a new chewer... I want you to try Husky and Grizzly and Stokers. That's just what I've tried, and all of them are good. If I had to name them in the list, uh, Husky Mint. Well, Husky's my favorite. Hang on. Wrong. Skull Peach. Love Skull Peach. And then Husky Mint. And then... Man, I don't know. Uh, Probably Stokers, Wintergreen, and then Grizzly Wintergreen. And then, you know, from there on, I need to try more. Uh, like I said, any new flavors you guys want me to try, I'll be willing to do it. Um, I'm going to have my buddy Alex, because he chews Copenhagen, that's all he chews. So, we're going to be doing a video, I'm going to do a video with him, he's been chewing a lot longer than me. But, uh, all in all, I would say, if it's your first time chewing, don't dip this. But, maybe after your first two cans, I would do it. I mean, I like it. It's something I could chew. I, would, I wouldn't I would turn it down if someone offered it to me. And I'll probably buy a can here and there. Um, I got a lot of cans, you know. And, it's just, I always come up with money and I have someone that'll buy it for me. Oh, and good story, by the way. Yesterday... I went, or it was the day before that, I went to go buy Chew at a store, because all my friends are saying, oh yeah, this sell you Chew even though you're underage. I'm only 15. I'll be 16 June 29th. I expect a lot of birthday comments. If you guys love me, you'll do it. <laughs> Anyways, I go up there, I'm like, you know, here, I want some Husky Mint. She takes my ID, and it goes, wah, wah, wah. And I'm like, oh shit. She takes it, and she says, I have to keep this. I'm like, no, you don't. <laughs> but anyways, she said, well, give me your number. 
I gave her a fake number because I didn't want to, you know, have her call my parents. And, sorry, my fucking computer went blank. Uh, anyways, so, I get a, I wake up in the morning, you know, I'm on the computer having a good time, completely forgot about it. Ding dong, answer the door, it was a cop. Um, I forgot that my address was on the permit, and he came and told my parents, and I thought I was going to get chewed out. But it turns out, my dad said, I can't tell you to do anything that I, you know, don't do anything that I do, or something like that. I can do it. I can pretty much chew now. It's good. Um, he smokes cigarettes, but I'd rather chew. And he's cool with it. He don't like it, but there's nothing he can really, and he said, you know, Whenever he said, I can't tell you not do something that I do, I'm like, eh, that's, that's a good point. I'm going to, you know, I'm going to take advantage of that. Anyways, that's a story that happened yesterday. Um, so, yeah, I was in a lot of trouble. Only for like an hour, though. And I was good. And then, you know, anyways, yeah, I, you know, like I said, I appreciate you guys commenting on my videos and subscribing. I, you know, all my subscribers, I really appreciate it. But, anyways, Grizzly, really good chew. Well, it's pretty good. 8 out of 10. That's, I'll, I'll classify that as 8 out of 10. Really good chew. Um, yeah, so I like it. Go out and try it, but not if you're a beginner chewer. Um, other than that, I don't know what else to say. Thank you, guys. I guess I'm done. Uh, this is an awkward moment, isn't it? Okay, well, this time I'm going to end all my videos now. Alright, this is all about Albert. My video is done. Keep dipping.